Okay, so we've done our sprouting and talk about that in another video. And so here's the sprouts that we're going to use for our microgreens. And we got these from Mums, and it's a mixture, salad greens. So I've prepared, so this is just one of those takeout for sushi containers. And I have, this is about four days. And so we're going to spread this on here. So what I've used is um, in this container, I put a, a chamois cloth underneath it to hold some moisture so these wouldn't dry out. And I'm just going to spread these uh, sprouted seeds on here. So we've got lots of room here. Now you can keep these as sprouts and put them on your salads, but I thought that I would take it one step further and we would um, try some microgreens because microgreens are super healthy for you. They're super nutritionally dense. They have incredible nutrient value for the size of it. You get the whole plant in a, in a few little morsels of sprouts. There are some people that are selling them at the Qualicum Beach Farmer's Market. And again, if you can use these and eat these regularly, they really supplement your nutrition. They alkalize your blood and keep you super healthy, build your immune system in these in this colder part of the of the season when we're more susceptible to those things. And so spread these out over here. Now there's a number of people that suggest that you want to apply pressure to these. And they suggest a pressure of about five pounds. So what I've done should be good is take another container and they said five pounds. This is a five pound brick we had laying around. So I'll just put that right there. And I'll put this out of the way. And we'll leave it for a few days to see what happens. Okay, so here we are. These are the microgreens. After a few days in the container, this is just a sushi container with a paper towel and we have a little bit of a chamois cloth underneath to absorb the, the water and keep it uh, well watered. So here they are, nice dark green compared to the other uh, pitchers. And now we can start harvesting them. This can com come completely out of here. I can pull this right up. Take this out. And cut my microgreens. And that's it. No fancy container. Don't need any, um, any soil or anything for this. And they're pretty darn healthy. It's as easy as that. Thanks for tuning in.